everyone, my name is Miss Melanie and I work at AHC Inc. And I know a lot of you that are out there from Woodbury Park and Fort Henry, Virginia Gardens, Harvey Hall, and Gates of Boston. For those of you there and elsewhere that I don't know, hello. Thanks for tuning in to Tuesday Tales. Please join us every Tuesday for this and um, you can also subscribe with the red button at the bottom of your screen. So I'm here um, along with my cat Willow um, to read you a book. And the name of this book, this tale, is What Would You Do With a Problem? And it is by Kobe Yamada. Let's get started. Okay. I don't know how it happened, but one day I had a problem. I didn't want it. I didn't ask for it. I really didn't like having a problem, but it was there. Why is it here? What does it want? What do you do with a problem? I thought I wanted to make it go away. I shoot it. I scowled at it. I tried ignoring it, but nothing worked. I started to worry about my problem. What if it swallows me up? What if my problem sneaks up and gets me? What if it takes away all of my things? I worried a lot. I worried about what would happen. I worried about what could happen. I worried about this and I worried about that. And the more I worried, the bigger my problem became. I wished it would just disappear. I tried everything I could do to hide from it. I even found ways to disguise, disguise myself, but it bound me. And the more I avoided my problem, the more I saw it everywhere. I thought about it all the time. I didn't feel good. I couldn't take it anymore. This has to stop, I declared. Maybe I was making my problem bigger and scarier than it actually was. After all, my problem hadn't really swallowed me up or attacked me. I realized I had to face it. So even though I didn't want to, even though I was really afraid, I got ready and I tackled my problem. When I got face to face with it, I discovered something. My problem wasn't what I thought it was. I discovered it had something beautiful inside. My problem held an opportunity. It was an opportunity for me to learn and to grow, to be brave, to do something. It showed me that it was important to look closely because some opportunities only come once. So, now I see problems differently. I'm not afraid of them anymore because I know their secret. Every problem has an opportunity for something good. You just have to look for it. The end. And again, this was what do you do with a problem? And it was for AHC Inc's um, Tuesday tale 
please subscribe and tune in again next week and Tuesdays after that. Thanks so much and have a good day.